it's time to learn about a <coughs> magical person, Mr. Mario. <coughs> yeah, um, but who is this person with his hat, his mustache, his nice shirt, and that big round? <coughs> Born in 1928, this is how his father first responded to him. What the fuck is that? Mario received so much love from his parents. That they threw him to the side of the road. Just talk about your life as a kid. Mario was taken into an orphanage in 1930, where he met his brother Luigi. The two of them then became friends ever since. Mario, number one. Mario, number two, Life for Mommy was quite different. Where did it go? He was perfect in class. Well, sort of. Ah! Right! He was very popular. Mario, what the fuck? He also met his first love. Whoa! I've been really trying, baby. I know. Grab a hold back. SHUT UP YOU GODDAMN b But his reign didn't last forever. In the middle of the school year, Mario was found using drugs. These drugs cause dramatic effects. He's actually acting normal right now. Mario's Hello. rampage will go Hello. on and on. Get the fuck down from there! No. Eventually, Mario burnt down the whole school. But Mario had hope. Well, not really. But still, he had some kind of chance. How did it feel to be on drugs and be so hopeless? <laughs> At age 17, a miracle happens. What did I do? Oh no! <laughs> Mario starts his new career as a plumber. Many adventures inside the pipes. <laughs> then one day he received a phone call. Hello! From Princess Peach! Dear Mario, please come to the castle. You motherfucker! Yours truly, Princess Toadstool. Hi, the princess. She's a bitch! This is Mario's first look at the castle, and a new age of Mario's life begins. Mario. Instead of cleaning pipes, Peach was nowhere to be seen. Instead, there was a large fat turtle in the castle. <laughs> right. After making Bowser cry like a baby, Mario will keep visiting the castle. <laughs> Oh. Mario, Peach, and Luigi then became like a happy family. Except Mario and Peach sort of. <laughs> Always good in the Mushroom Kingdom. Until Mario stumbled across a company called Nintendo. Back then, Nintendo was a company that was just starting, and they were looking for mascots to use. So Mario went up to Nintendo and said, You know what kids like? Mario! My body is ready. And that's how Mario is the mascot of Nintendo. What? Don't believe me? Look it up. Nintendo created millions of games about Mario and his life throughout the Mushroom Kingdom. And Mario became a millionaire. Yippee. Again, rumor broke out that Mario was taking drugs in Nintendo. 
all this stuff started to happen. Yada yada yada. Maui got fired, and now he's another fat ass at home. Oh, he stayed the mascot of Nintendo. La, la, la. Now he's just living his days fat and working for a sexy, sexy man. Uh, yeah. So live on, you fat piece of spaghetti. And we'll miss you.